Sometime during this quarantine, I felt completely alone. I mean, I usually don't mind being alone, but this time I felt like I'm completely invisible and I felt like no matter how much I scream, no one would ever hear me. I got used to quarantine quickly when it started. I had a routine and I had weekly calls with people and I had some relatives near me. But yet for some reason I felt like I was just in the background and that it doesn't matter if I'm there or not. It all started one day when I was looking at Instagram stories of my friends. I saw one story that showed two of my friends catching up even if they're miles away. I felt the closeness and the love they have for each other and then I asked myself, would there be someone who'd check up on me randomly the way they did to each other? I checked my messages and all I saw were group conversations. I began to wonder if I put up this image of me being unavailable or unreachable because it feels weird that it's so quiet around me. Then my mind took me back to all the time where my circle of friends have their own groups without me, or when we'd walk as a group and I'd find myself at the end or the front alone, or whenever I feel like I'm physically there but I felt like I'm miles away. In an attempt to connect with others and get out of this loneliness, I tried to make the first move and reach out to the people around me. I remember there was this one conversation where they told me they'll get back to me about a certain topic I wanted to discuss, but it never happened. I waited for days, weeks, and it took months, and it never happened. My mind even got so low to the point that it made me remember all the times I felt like I was brushed aside, like I didn't matter to anyone. As my mind was going in the spiral, my phone rang. And my hopes went up, thinking that someone could finally just want to talk to me out of the blue. It turns out it was a friend who needed help for something. I don't mind helping my friends, really. I love doing it. But it could have been nice that at that moment when I was being engulfed by loneliness, someone reached out just to say hi. I get that my friends and I have different lives and we don't need to be connected 24-7. But I just felt like it would be nice if someone just took a minute or so just to say what's up. It's been like this for me for years and it's only now that it bothered me to my core. So there I was. I felt so alone. The earth continued to spin while I just faded into the background. More and more noise came into my head and I was slowly drowning in this loneliness. I just felt so sad and alone. I wanted to escape this mess in my head, so I went on a long cold shower to drown my thoughts and to talk to God. I gave up this heavy burden in my heart, and there at my loneliest, where no eye in this world will ever see me, I sought company from the ever-present and ever-loving Father. I felt so alone in this world, yet I was reminded that Jesus is with me. When my heart ached for company, He's there willing to take a seat beside me. When I fell into the background, He's there ready to stand by my side. The truth is, as I talked to God at that moment, He comforted me and peace set in my mind. Slowly, the pain of being completely alone vanished as I began to understand that God is present in my hardships and that He is willing to walk the hard parts with me. You see, Jesus loves me and he loves you. I'm not alone. I know that now. My friend, if you're in the same situation I was, know that you are not alone.